All right, this is day one of the fishing extravaganza. I'm here in Punta Gorda. It's right by Charlotte Harbor, Port Charlotte. And uh, this is my first morning, kind of got a late start because I wasn't sure if I was gonna get my hotel key, but they did leave it in the room. It was just in an odd spot. So here I am at the pier across the street from the motel. I want to get a good look at things, see what the conditions are like. Nice tea colored water, which I like. Very nice snook and red water. It's kind of a little late to fish right now, I think, but I'm gonna go talk to the, looks like the tide's low too. Mangroves, lots of mangroves, but it's really low right now, so. Kind of see where I'm at. All right, I'm gonna check things out. I can't see some man. It's very, very shallow here. All right. Well, there's not much to see here. The water's really dark. Um, so I guess I'm gonna go to the bait shop and talk to the people that know where the fish are. Lady at the hotel said go to actual uh, Boca Grande Beach. It's a good spot. So I'll go to talk to the bait people. Uh, maybe get some live shrimp and see, see where I can catch some fish. Maybe I'm a wuss, but I hate getting a late start and not knowing where I'm going. Went to the bait shop, talked to the guys there. Of course, and always a little tight-lipped at the bait shop when you first go in there. It was hard to sort of coax information from them. Uh, I got a couple spots from shore. Now, it doesn't sound too promising, but it's bridge-type fishing, which you know it makes sense for the area. Um, so I guess my best bet is to give it a shot there. Uh, not my favorite type of fishing, just sort of from the bridge like that but whatever we'll try it and then um, I don't know maybe I'm gonna go out with a guide tomorrow it's only slightly less uh, expensive uh, as a boat to rental myself and you know they'll put you on some fish usually so I may go out with a guide tomorrow I gotta figure that out uh, anyway all right I'm gonna eat some breakfast real quick of course we know what that breakfast is and then I'm gonna go fish from the bridge, see if I can't catch some fish. All right, I'm at uh, the bridge here. It's uh, 41 going into uh, Charlotte Harbor. I'm gonna strap on the old uh, GoPro, which will be my first time using it. If I can figure this out. Um, let's see if I can't catch any fish over here. Let's see. Work. Yes. I feel a little strange walking around with this thing. It makes me seem very confident that I'm going to catch a fish. That's what it's telegraphing. Like this is how confident I am that I'm going to catch a fish. So I got this going. So, all right, I'm going to go fish under this bridge here. See if I can't catch something. Alright, I'm trying this bridge here. It doesn't look very promising. It's really shallow, lots of rocks, uh, very windy. You don't really know where the structure is or where the drop offs are. So they told me to come over here, but they said it's really windy, it doesn't look very promising. So we'll see. First spot was a bust. Uh, started to get a lot of bites, but I think they're all mangrove snappers. Uh, I just didn't like the, the position I was in. It was kind of a. They said to come here, but it didn't look great. 
I think this is the kind of place where you just throw bait in and just sit and wait, which I don't like. I don't mind it, but I need, I need to be able to sense the conditions and, and try to work bait as well. So, I guess it's high tide right now, I assume. So maybe I'll head over to Boca Grande Beach and fish from the shore. Always fish on the in the ocean. This is the Peace River, apparently. The river fishing is kind of hit or miss for me. Uh, unless I know the spots. So anyway, all right, I'm gonna try some something else. One mangrove is what I've caught so far. One fish. This is very pretty. You can see all kinds of reef and shallow uh, flats. Water's crystal clear over here. Kind of similar to Sanibel, I guess we're kind of close. This is Gasparilla Sound. Oh, wow, look at this. Ah, oh, that is gorgeous. So I'm gonna try the um, Boca Grande fishing pier. Looks like there's a couple cars up ahead, but it's kind of, it's only 3.30 on a Thursday, so I'm hoping it won't be too busy. No idea what it's gonna be like, but whatever, the water's gorgeous here. There's a few people fishing here. We'll check it out first. Concerned earlier because I was tired and never fished here. And obviously, I'm fishing alone, as you can see. And I got snagged. Anyway, I'm feeling a little bit better now that I know there's fish around here. It's gorgeous. Charlotte Harbor is just too, the water is just too dark and rivery. I guess it's not a river, it makes sense. Uh, I like this blue water. Seldom that I get skunked on a fishing outing. 
if I can just catch one nice game fish, a nice snook, 